Alzheimer's disease is a type of dementia, which means a loss of memory and thinking skills that interferes with daily life. Alzheimer's disease is the most common type of dementia, accounting for 60% to 70% of all cases. Alzheimer's disease is not a normal part of aging, although it usually affects older people. The average age of onset is 65 years, but some people may develop it earlier or later. Causes of Alzheimer's disease Alzheimer's disease is caused by changes in the brain that damage and kill brain cells over time. These changes include the buildup of abnormal protein clumps called amyloid plaques and twisted fibers called toll tangles, which interfere with the communication between brain cells. Another change is the loss of connections between brain cells, which reduces the brain's ability to function properly. These changes usually start in parts of the brain that are responsible for memory, such as the hippocampus and the entorhinal cortex, and then spread to other areas that control language, reasoning, and social behavior. As a result, people with Alzheimer's disease experience a gradual decline in their cognitive abilities and their personality. The exact causes of these changes are not fully understood yet, but researchers believe that it is a complex interaction of genetic, environmental, and lifestyle factors. Some of these factors can be controlled, and other cannot be controlled. The most important risk factor for Alzheimer's disease is age. The older you are, the higher your chance of developing Alzheimer's disease. About 1 in 10 people over 65 years old have Alzheimer's disease. However, age alone does not cause Alzheimer's disease. Some people may live well into their 90s without any signs of dementia. Another risk factor for Alzheimer's disease is genetics. Some people may inherit genes that increase their risk of developing Alzheimer's disease. For example, there is a gene called apolipoprotein E. This gene is known to increase your risk of getting Alzheimer if you have it. Symptoms of Alzheimer's disease The symptoms of Alzheimer's disease vary from person to person and depend on the stage of the disease. The early signs of Alzheimer's disease include difficulty remembering recent events or conversations, misplacing items, getting lost in familiar places, having trouble finding words or expressing thoughts and showing poor judgment or decision-making. These symptoms may be mild at first and may not interfere with daily activities, but they get worse over time and affect a person's ability to function independently. As the disease progresses, the symptoms become more severe and include forgetting important information such as names of family members or personal history, having trouble recognizing faces or objects, repeating questions or statements over and over, becoming confused about time or place. The patient may also experience mood swings or personality changes, such as becoming irritable, anxious, depressed, or aggressive. Other than that, the disease may also cause difficulty performing simple tasks, such as dressing or eating. In the late stages of Alzheimer's disease, people may lose their ability to communicate verbally or non-verbally, to control their movements or bodily functions, and to care for themselves. They may also become more susceptible to infections or other complications that can lead to death. Diagnosis of Alzheimer's disease There is no single test that can diagnose Alzheimer's disease with certainty. The diagnosis is based on a comprehensive evaluation that includes medical history, physical examination, neurological examination, blood tests, and brain imaging. The doctor will ask about the symptoms, their onset and progression, family history of dementia, and other medical conditions that may affect cognition. MRI or CT scans may also be ordered to look for any abnormalities in the brain, such as tumors, bleeding, or atrophy. Treatment for Alzheimer's disease. Unfortunately, there is no cure for Alzheimer's disease at the present. The available treatments aim to improve or slow down the symptoms and enhance the quality of life of people with the disease. The treatments usually include medications and non-drug therapies. There are two types of drugs that are approved for treating Alzheimer's disease which are cholinesterase inhibitors and mimantine. Cholinesterase inhibitors work by increasing the levels of a chemical in the brain called acetylcholine, which is involved in memory and learning. And mimantine works by blocking the effects of another chemical in the brain 
called glutamate, which is involved in nerve cell communication. Non-drug therapies for Alzheimer's include cognitive stimulation, behavioral therapy, and physical exercise. These therapies aim to stimulate the brain, reduce stress, improve mood, and maintain physical health.